Who the hell are you? My name's John William Goodnight. I'm a circuit judge, sworn jurisdiction in this territory. They appoint him judge to the circuit of Wyoming, and Wyoming happens to be the place where his parents were killed uh, by a man who was never brought to justice for it. Yeah, well, we don't need no judge out here. Mister, you're lucky I am a judge. If I weren't sworn to uphold the law, I'd shoot you right now. It asks that simple question, which is really a big question. What would I do if I had the chance to get revenge on this guy? Would I do the thing that is just and lawful, or would I just satisfy my own personal vengeance and kill him when I have the chance? This story takes place at a much simpler time when it was one guy. And it was his judgment, and he looked in your eyes, and he looked in your heart, and he said, you, "You're guilty, or you're innocent, and this is what's going to happen." And that guy had the responsibility not only of making that decision, but enforcing the punishment. Jason Priestley is the director of this movie because um, I trust him. You know, we're definitely far beyond 90210, but we it brings us back together in one sense. But we've never been apart. I mean, we always talk on the phone. We've always stayed close friends. Not just me and Jason, but me and Ian and Brian as well. The guys of the show have always had a really good, strong core group, and we continue to have it to this day. While there are no laws on the books of this territory protecting Indians' rights, there is a law that says you can't hold a human being for no reason. Jason's from Vancouver, British Columbia, which is where we made this film, and and the director needed to be from Canada also. So when they told me that, it was a very short list in my mind. I thought I know a guy; he's Canadian, and uh, it would allow me to have my creative fingerprints all over this thing, and it wouldn't bother Jason. We don't we don't come from a place of ego with each other, and we are all human beings here, regardless of our heritage. And as such, you men are free to go.